Hello everybody, this is Downsprite here. Today I'll be showing you a quick tutorial for my first video on how to add a background into Game Maker Studio 2. I've seen quite a lot of people ask how because I think it's a bit different in Game Maker Studio 1.4 so but it's still very very simple. So here I have my game it's a very simple platformer showing um, how the mechanics work basically it's just simply using square sprites. So let's get straight into it we're gonna create a new sprite imports go to your background where your background um, sprite is mine's here bg underscore grass got this from a youtuber named heartbeast by the way he's a great youtuber great shooter as well so yeah just select that and that's simply all you're going to do let's name this usually i give the backgrounds naming conventions of background files even though they're still sprites just something i do um, it doesn't really matter about the origin point. So now we're going to go into tile sets here. I don't have any at the moment, so let's right click, create. Let's name it TL underscore grass. I'm very sorry if you can hear my keyboard. I'm going to have to fix that for later videos. I'm making this one in quite a hurry actually. <laughs> so we're going to select the sprite BG grass. <coughs> and let's see, 16 by 16. That's absolutely fine. For the tile sets, of course, you want the top left one to be blank like this. So if we were to change this to 32, and then 32, the entire thing goes blank because it's only one tile. So let's get 16 by 16. That's great. Now we're going to go into our room. Open up the room editor. If you don't have this, you can go up here and click the layer view. And um, so here is the tiles. Here's the tile view here. In fact, was it? Okay, alright, yeah. The layer view is here, sorry. So you can do this, click on the tiles here, and then this window will pop up. You select the TL grass, and you can zoom in. And you see here there's actually three different sort of tiles. Um, just get one, and if you just want it all to be the same, you press F, and um, click, then we can drag. Oops, drag that there, there we go. That's how it works in Game Maker Studio 2 here. <coughs> you don't have depth either on sprites, you simply use the instances and all these layers. And um, you see here, all the objects I've put in, all the separate objects I've put in. Um, if I were to put this, move this one up to the top, it would be behind everything. Um, and vice versa. So yeah, that was how to add a background in. <coughs> I hope you enjoyed, I hope it helped you. Um, you can now turn off the video, but just for 10 seconds, I like to say. Um, <coughs> also, I'm going to be doing many more of these tutorials. I started this channel just yesterday, actually. And um, I plan on uploading a lot of tutorials about Game Maker, um, Pixel Edit here, uh, Stencil Works as well. So feel free to subscribe if you want tutorials frequently, very simple ones to follow. I'll answer every single comment I get. Have a nice day.